Hi everybody, hope you guys are all doing well. Um, I thought I would show you another what's in my bag video. Uh, I feel like I don't, <laughs> look at this is, okay, let me just start off with this. This is a lug jumper. I think they're calling it a tote. Um, it is pretty large. Um, I wish I had a tape measure. You can hear Zoe. She's like just off cam over here digging in her bed. Um, there are two dog beds right behind where I'm filming this. So hopefully, hopefully this ends up working out okay. Um, anyhow, this is a lug jumper um, tote. They also have the jumper backpack. You can see I've got like the tonal um, hardware right there. This is in the color Ocean. I bought this when it was a, what was it? QVC too big deal. I don't think it was a today's special value. I think it was a big deal. Um, was when I bought this earlier this summer. I just thought that this color was beautiful. It's like a pool colored <laughs> um, bag. When I was seeing it on TV, I was a little worried about buying it. I thought it might like lean to peacock, but it really is. Um, I don't know if the lighting is doing it justice in here. The lighting might change as we go through the video because um, I'm in my office and I have these lights set on a timer to change to like working lights at a certain time of day. So anyway, um, it's not too peacock. It's more of a like mallard blue mixed with like a sea blue. I'm making a lot of hand gestures, but they're behind the camera right now. Anyway, I do really like this bag. Um, it's, I don't want to say it's too big, but I've gotten used to carrying much smaller bags. And so I definitely don't use the space to its fullest. Um, if you like carrying bigger bags, I think this would be a really good bag for you. So, um, it comes with two uh, shoulder straps. They have this grippy on them, which is very good until you're wearing your hair down. If you have long hair like I do, it gets caught on this and it's painful. I will say that. So I don't use these much. If I am using these, it really is just like to hold the bag in the crook of my arm and then I wear the crossbody strap the rest of the time. Um, also hooked on the crossbody, I have my lug. Uh, this is, I think, what's it? Is it shimmer black? It's my, it's a black heart pouch from Lug. I had somebody ask about that in the last video that I posted where I had this on my bag. Um, I, I do like it. I actually ordered another set and they sent me the wrong color. <laughs> so I'm getting another other set in like a week or two. Anyway, I really like, um, I like the heart pouches. I keep my masks in there. One of them actually might be floating around in the bag. Anyway, um, on the front, you've got two of these, like the puddle jumper pockets. Um, and these are very similar to the pockets that you'll find on like a full size puddle jumper. And they're a pretty good size. Um, I mean, like hand for scale. And this, I threw in there. It is literally empty. I was seeing if my pill case would fit inside of it and it does. Um, but I just kind of shoved that into one of these. I don't think there's anything in the outside. Uh, when I worked, um, in an office, I keep my business cards and my, um, I used to carry a puddle jumper for work and I keep my business cards on one side and then business cards other people gave me <laughs> on the other side. I feel like that's the perfect thing for there. And this other outside pocket, I've got my hand sanitizer spray in champagne toast from Bath and Body Works and that's it in that pocket. So, um, the zippers on this are really good. I like them a lot and um, they're very easy to slide back and forth. Up here, I'm filming with my current phone. So this is my old phone, but this is an iPhone 7 Plus. So it's a big phone and it fits fully in that kind of uh, signature, right, lug pocket there. Um, I showed you guys this heart pouch already once before, but this is over here by these magnetic outside pockets and there's one on each side I don't keep anything in them I think if I were to keep something in them it would probably be something like my sunglasses um 
or if I brought a water bottle with me or like a, a can of sparkling water or Diet Coke or something with me, that's what I'd stick in those. But they are, I mean, they, they're, they've got some good size to them. I love when Lug adds those magnetic closures on the side pockets. Um, I'll show you the back <laughs> once I get to that, but here's the inside of the bag. And like I said, I don't keep as much in this as I like humanly could, but I do keep uh, everything that I want in here. So um, this is technically a flask. It was on sale on Amazon, but I use it for water. I have a, uh, there's two pen slots here. Oh, that's in a pouch. Let me go show you the pouch. So that's in a pouch. I have two pen slots here. Um, I only keep one pen. And yeah, two pen slots. Oh, and then my key bungee. And on the key bungee, I just have like a purse light. Um, I have some wet ones. This is like a, I don't want to say a full-size package, but it's like a full-size travel pack of these. I have a random loose mask. Went and got my nails done last night. And so, like, I threw, of course, my watch and jewelry and everything in here, too. I'm still using the Flamingo Mint, Mint Flamingo uh, wallet. Again, you got that cute tonal hardware. Um, I really like the size of this wallet and I like that it has, of course, the strap. So, uh, I'll keep using this for now. What else? Oh, my sunglasses. These I actually got at the QVC outlet. Let me know if you guys want to do like a, a shop with me at the QVC outlet because I'm obsessed. We go like every other weekend. Um, but I picked these up. They're Privé Revo sunglasses. Um, for, like I said, from the QVC outlet, if you've not tried the Privé Revo sunglasses before, I got purple <laughs> or pink, pinky purple. Oh, there I am. Huh? Um, and it also, I just left this in here, but what I like about this little sunglass case is it folds up flat. So it makes it really easy. Like once you take your sunglasses off, it doesn't take up quite so much room in your bag and then once you want to like refold it you just like unfurl it stick that there stick those in and done what else do I have in here let's see oh my um ah my pill case um I think since the last time I showed you this I added a shark sticker to it uh, this I keep Oh gosh, all kinds of stuff in it. Like if I'm just traveling overnight, I'll take this with me. Um, I have my prescriptions, but I've also got like Pepto. I've got um, motion sickness meds. I've got Advil. I've got um, Tylenol. I've got my vitamins. All sorts of things in that little case. Um... And then that's it, I guess, for the main pouch. And then here in the side pouch, I always just toss my AirPods in there. And I have, this is, um, I think this is the same one that I showed last time. It is the Mally I Love My Lips Tinted Lip Balm in Watermelon. And I'm like, I can't see to tell for sure if, I can't see around the camera. Okay, uh, some Starbursts. What else oh and my ring is in here I'm like oh where'd it go my ring um also a QVC purchase <laughs> anyway so that's what's in the main pouch oh looks like I am caught here in this back pouch here it is very large I've seen people fit like full notebooks and things in it um, I don't carry that much stuff like you've seen. So back here, I just have, um, a couple of tampons and a pad and that's it. So that is what I carry with me. Um, in this bag. Yeah. Like I said, I like it. It's a little big. Um, I think I'm going to probably switch into my, 
uh, into another bag here in the next day or two. And then when I do that, I will show you, of course, what makes the cut and what I decide to uh, bring with me. So yeah, thanks for this, for watching this just like little tour of the mini puddle jumper, not mini puddle jumper, of the jumper tote. Um, I do like this bag a lot. Like I said, if I carried more stuff, it would definitely fit everything that I needed. Um, and yeah, I, I guess that's it. Thanks again for tuning in and I will see you all soon again with another video. Bye.